by vessels of the British India Steam Navigation Company, better known as BI, whose funnels, black with their two white bands, and house flags, white bird G's with a red diagonal cross, are a welcome and familiar sight throughout the East to all those that go down to the sea in ships and have business in great waters. In fact, every one of the things we have traced in the course of our journey might have travelled B.I. in a British India cargo or passenger ship on one of the regular routes. are waiting for the tide. Some stand ready to leave their moorings. Aboard others, the work of preparation for sailing goes steadily on. Some will carry cargoes across the world. Others will be taking people. Sometimes whole families to new experiences in faraway places. The pilot will navigate this ship down to the sea. For the men of the ships, this is no dream. This is life itself, life in its most active, fascinating and worthwhile form. A life without which our world would virtually come to a standstill. For it is the ships and the men who run them that populate the seas and great oceans, making them vital arteries in the bloodstream of travel and commerce. Out at sea, far away from the confinement of cities, the reality of the job springs to life it has a purpose. This, indeed, is the life for a man. <laughs> 